It brought tears to my eyes for these players and so for our fans. You walk in, it's something special. Everything's new. I mean, we, we tore up everything outdoors, built all the new courts, all new stands, bathrooms, concession stands, lights, sound system, scoreboards, benches, umpire chairs, cameras for streaming. Everything is comparable from indoor and outdoor. The same courts are there. So if there's bad weather, they're playing indoors, it's still the same surface as they're playing outside. I've never seen so many dump trucks moving dirt in my entire life. The stands are just amazing and sight lines for fans to watch matches uh, are just gonna be amazing. So yeah, they, it's brand new outdoor facility and just everything is you know, first class. I just love how much Carolina Blue it is. You walk in and you know you're at the University of North Carolina, where the other ones it just feels like six courts in a row and some, and some chairs for people to watch, whereas this one really kind of has a good feel to it. I think it represents Carolina well. It shows that we're putting a lot of money and attention into sports that sometimes aren't always as recognized. We are a well-respected team in the U.S. and being able to have like a state-of-the-art facility shows we are at this elite level. I think just for us as players, it just shows how much support we have as a program. The, the amount of people that came both financially and just you know as a, as a community came together and to make this happen over the course of the last, I'm sure they've been fundraising for a while, but especially over the last like two, three years, it just really says a lot about Carolina tennis and just you know, how many people want to see us succeed. This is great for our student athletes. You know, most happy for our student athletes that they can come in and train in this, you know, in these lights. I mean, these are championship lights that we can play night matches now. We can have tournaments and, you know, be playing here in the evenings. He's out. He's out. For our players to reap the benefits to play in this facility, I'm really excited for them because they've uh, they've worked hard and, and they deserve and many future Tar Heels get to reap the benefits of all the past alumni players. That's the probably the favorite part of my job is being able to help the student athletes. I think it's great that we can provide a facility to them that's equal to their level of performance and tennis is certainly no exception with both teams being top 10 and super competitive in the indoor national championships and in the outdoor season in the spring. So it's exciting to be able to give back to the programs that are putting in so much hard work here in the year. It's encouraging. We want to show off the facility and really put our best foot forward starting more outdoor season and just really represent Carolina well. It's now my pleasure that by the power vested in me by the Board of Trustees, the University of North Carolina at Chapel Hill to officially dedicate the Tuning Tennis Center. We were fortunate to have a ribbon cutting earlier to rename the facility after a donor that's been very supportive of both programs, uh, very involved in this uh, renovation project, great ideas brought to the table by him and his family. So we're, uh, we're excited to have that kind of support here at the university for athletics as well as uh, other university endeavors. I give credit to Tom Tuning, Keith Stoneman, Tim Smith, who was sort of the driving force behind it and the Rams Club that really got it off the ground. And to find it, I mean, I've been here 34 years and we've talked about it a lot, you know, but to see it as a reality is, uh, it's incredible. I've been here 20 years now, so I think both programs have done extremely well. So I think the next stage for us is to have an amazing facility and the Tunings and the Brysons and the others that have done so much for our program, really given us this opportunity. Like I pinch myself every day. It's one of the best in the country. The quality of everything, the lights, the championship stadium, the courts, the Argyles, you know, as you walk in, the setting when you walk in, you know, it's a, it's a very special place.